on full America kill was 1134. To the wheels. To the wheels. 1134 horse to the wheels. This is bad dog. Yo, 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 what's up everyone? Welcome back to the vlog. I'm on the way over to my buddy Jeff's house. He's gonna take me for a ride in the Super Vet. If you guys are an OG fan of mine, you will recognize Jeff. Uh, he was featured on my Snapchat Weekly as Gay Jeff about two years ago when we used to work at the ballet together. Ooh, Maserati. He was also featured as Donald Trump in the same old music video. And if you don't remember that, I will add a link to that video in the description below. I'm filming on my real camera today because my GoPro has shit the bed after three uses in the audio department. Still trying to get that sorted out, so hopefully the audio sounds all right on this. I haven't had time to test it or anything. I do have a $250 Rode microphone that would work on this camera, but JP thought it would be a good idea to take that to California with him this week. So we're running with the stock audio on the Canon T5i, so hopefully it's not terrible. It's gotta be better than what the fucking GoPro has right now. Chat bump. Unbelievable. I think Trent went to Ann's fabric for this seat cover. <laughs> Probably did. Jesus I, Christ. I kinda like the little Corvette tip. Is that a Corvette tip? I don't know. It's a AutoZone special. <laughs> but I think it looks kinda cool. It's sick. Nice. Alright, let's show them your fleet before we go to the vet. 2000 Volkswagen Jetta TDI, 160,000 miles, stock, lowered on some $400 coilovers. You know, to be Sick. honest, I can't even remember the brand. Look at that exhaust. <laughs> Jesus, I thought you were gonna get the tractor flap on there. <sighs> My uncle still needs to send it to me. He says he's got me a bracket and two little flappers. And this is the white buffalo, right? The white buffalo. That's right, and this one used to be owned by my buddy Trevor, which he sold it to Jeff. I see you still haven't fixed the fucking <laughs> step that doesn't fold back up. Yep. Some decent meat on her. You got new tires for her? Oh yeah, I forgot. The Super Cruiser. <laughs> Sick. Got All right, here's the beast in question. What happened to your hood? It doesn't fit anymore. But I figured, let America reveal herself. Now let's give him some specs. How many bald eagles does this bad boy put out to the wheels? On full America kill was 1134. To the wheels. To the wheels. 1134 horse to the wheels. This bad dog. <laughs> Look at that bald eagle hydro dipped. Blower. Blower. <laughs> Damn. That is some freedom right there. So Cletus would be proud. Cletus would be proud. I hope Cletus and Mike from Street Speed see this one day. Because I'm going to title it like LOL Street Speed or something. <laughs> so hopefully he sees it. Alright, what other specs can you give them? 408 cubic inch iron block motor. Uh, it's pretty traditional. Just heads, cam, methanol. Um, it runs on pump gas. That's, that was our horsepower number on pump gas, which is pretty amazing. Gas here sucks ass and it's just 91 octane. T56. It's got the uh, 18 inch wheels with some DOT race master radials that hook okay. Shouldn't say that they don't really hook very good at all, but we'll hook it off. Let's see what else. Full exhaust. That's really about it. Nothing too crazy. Yeah, not crazy at all. 1100 horsepower. <laughs> Nothing too crazy over here. I think my van probably has like 200 horsepower. <laughs> So he's gonna take me for a drive in this thing, which I've never, uh, actually I have been in this once before. Funny story, so I was featured on that Payday Viceland deal. They wanted to make sure that I got to valet a nice car when they were there filming. So they had Jeff pull up in this, in this thing. So if you guys watch the episode, the, the vet that I valet, you'll see him get out of it and he fucking works there. He got to valet this one, but I've never like ripped on it. I just was in first gear around the port, so. I've never been in, in, in anything like this. I think the fastest car I've been in was Sam's uh, Aventador SV for the wanna work video, but I only got to go like zero to 40 in that. So <laughs> I've never really even been in like a super fast car, so it should be fun. What's up, you fucking nerd? What's up? You want these? Yeah, I want them. Fucking what size them. are they? 10 and a half. They might fit. You wear 11. But huh? you've you've had these for two years and now you're gonna give them to me? Dude, I've literally worn those things maybe twice. I've seen you at work in these like 60 times. <laughs> these, motherfuck six times. these motherfuckers have 250 <laughs> miles on them. It's easy. Dude, free 99. Yeah. Free Why don't you go blow the head gasket on your Subaru? Dude, you can't talk like that. It'll actually happen. <laughs> Gym, have my huge bottle of water with me, minding my own business, and then this 
stop to the light here and all of a sudden I see smoke and a bit of flame and I'm like, holy fucking shit, I'm on fire. <laughs> and then uh, I dipped over, I cut like two people off, I dipped over to the side over there, popped the hood, the car was like basically the under, the under carpet of the hood was on fire, completely burned, the top of my motor was on fire. I'm like, oh shit, so I took my water bottle that I had, sprayed it all out, fire was done, fucking kid and his dad come up and uh, dad's got a fire extinguisher with him, the fire was out and I told him no, 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 no and he put it out anyways, <laughs> just sprayed the whole entire thing. I said, doused it. Doused it and he comes up and after he <laughs> empties the whole thing on the car and he says, you're welcome. <laughs> and, then and then walks back to his car and leave. I'm like, thank you, thank you. Other than that though, that sucked really bad and then cars down after a little while after, blew head gasket, all that shit was fixed and back on the road again months later but you know it's been just it was been an easy journey you know race cars are expensive I don't really want to ride in here because I know I'm gonna want one yes. after <laughs> completely and <laughs> but, I totally understand but I don't think I want one because I would kill myself <laughs> I need like a GTR or something a little safer an R8 or something yeah something yeah. a little safer all-wheel drive that makes sense yeah Yeah? I feel like we did. I feel like we went 130 at least, because I felt like we were moving. We have made it to the food vlog at Chipotle here. God damn, first reactions for that. Fucking nuts. <laughs> what was your first reaction once you got that thing on this new setup? I scared the shit out of myself. <laughs> like, I, it's just, it's, it's so, it's so primal and evil and it's fast. a fucking beast. And like literally, like it wants you to rev it. So like higher revs, you gain more power because it just continually builds. So it, it, unless you get it in the big revs, you're not really feeling the big power. Yeah. But then when you get it above 4,500 RPM, it just, it, it flies like a, it's like a fucking rocket ship. Yeah, <laughs> dude, that thing just wants to go. <laughs> it's Fuck. pissed. Yeah, it is pissed. <laughs> That's a great way to describe it's it. So it's angry. Like driving Z06 is at work and you like just tap the gas and the rear end kicks out. Oh yeah. yeah. And that's only 650 at the crank. Oh, yeah. And that's 1100 at the wheels. <laughs> like, dude, it's stupid. The food vlog is back. <laughs> Chipotle. I know this is the debate of all time, but I think I prefer Chipotle over Chipotle. Really? Yeah. This is my first time with queso on the, because I know they just got it here. Uh -huh. But yeah, I like Chipotle like, better. They're about six years behind. Yeah. <laughs> like, but we have guac. <laughs> okay. So it's hard you actually do Get rid of this and get that, or both? I don't know. 
it's hard to get rid of this thing because it's yeah. just so fucking awesome. But this thing is awesome. But Jeff's gonna start up a YouTube channel soon, and then he can be uh, Reno's Street Speed 717 with his fleet of vehicles, which is exactly the same as Street Speed's almost. Except you got the Ford instead of the Duramax. I got this. There's your boy. Did he wave? He was all. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he like rolled down his window. I thought he was gonna say something. It's violent, but it cruises nice like this. Like. You could daily it. You could, and you want it. The to. shifts suck to daily, but yeah. other than that, like it's not yeah. bad. Shifting it sucks really bad. It's not an easy thing to drive, but once you're up to cruising speed, it's really not that bad. Yeah. Fuel economy sucks regardless. Yeah, how much does it get? I mean, to be honest, like I average like 12. Oh, that's not too bad. No, it's not horrible, it's like but what the van gets. All right, guys, just made it home from Jeff's house. Big thanks to him for letting me ride in the Super Vet. And he even bought me Chipotle after, so that was awesome of him, too. I'm going to link to his Instagram and his YouTube channel below in the description. As for me, for the rest of the day, more sitting in this here chair, getting some work done, so the camera's going off. So that's going to round it out for this vlog. So if you guys liked what you saw, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you're in for the first time, and we'll see you on the next video.